Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we are having one very interesting radical exponential equation. It is 3 power 3x plus 1 over 2 equal to cube root of 3 power 3x plus 241 over 2. We have to find out all real solutions. So let's get started by considering cube both sides. So I will write power 3, power 3. Now cube root and power 3 will be over. So we can write here 3 power 3x plus 241 divided by 2 in RHS. In LHS we can write 3 power 3x plus 1 divided by 2 whole cube. Now I will split or I will expand numerator and denominator in LHS first. So 3 power 3x it is plus 1 whole cube and 2 cube is 8. In RHS 3 power 3x as it is plus 241 divided by 2. Now I will multiply both sides with 8 so that this denominator will be over. So now 8 and 8 will be over. 2 I will cancel here by writing 4. So ultimately what we are having 3 power 3x plus 1 whole cube equal to 4 times 3 power 3x plus 241. Now let's multiply this 4. So 4 times 3 power 3x plus 4 times 241, it will be 964. Now I can split this 964 as 4 plus 960 plus 960. Now I will take 4 common from these two terms. So it will become 4 common in bracket 3 power 3x plus 1 plus 960. Now you can understand, we can substitute this bracket 3 power 3x plus 1 equal to a or t something. So let me write here, 3 power 3x plus 1 whole cube equal to 4 times 3 power 3x plus 1 plus 960. Now we will substitute this bracket 3 power 3x plus 1 equal to a suppose. So our equation will convert a cube equal to 4a plus 960 or we can write a cube minus 4a minus 960 equal to 0. This is one cubic equation. I will use rational root theorem. So let's find out all the possible eligible factors of constant term 960. It would be plus minus 1, plus minus 2, plus minus 3, plus minus 4, plus minus 5, plus minus 6, plus minus 8, plus minus 10 and so on. If you will check the leading coefficient, it is plus minus 1 only. Once we will take the ratio of constant to leading coefficient, we will get our eligible solution of this equation. Let's check. If I will suppose put a equal to 1, what will happen? 1 minus 4 minus 960. Because of 960 is big number, a small value of a won't satisfy. So let me consider a equal to 10 directly. So I can write 10 cube minus 4 times 10 minus 960. Let's check. 10 cube is 1000. 4 times 10, 40 minus 960. Yes, it is true. 1000 minus 1000. So I will write yes, this is true. And A equal to 10 is our base solution for this cubic equation. So let me write here a cube minus 4a minus 960 equal to 0 and using 
rational root theorem we concluded a equal to 10 is our base solution now we have to verify the other two solutions of this cubic equation so i will find out using sdm the remaining two solutions first so let us write all the coefficient of this cubic equation coefficient of a cube 1 coefficient of a square as it is absent so 0 coefficient of a minus 4 constant term minus 960 let's write the leading coefficient as it is 1 now i will multiply each number by this base solution so 10 times 1 10 10 10 times 10 100 add both 96 10 times 96 960 0 so here we concluded one quadratic equation coefficients so let's frame one quadratic equation a square plus 10a plus 96 equal to 0 now i will check only discriminant so discriminant will be b square minus 4ac so i will write b square as 10 square minus 4 times a is 1 c is 96 so this value is 100 minus 384 so overall this discriminant is coming out minus 284 negative value so complex solution will be there so we will say as we are calculating real values so we will reject this quadratic equation for our solution so i will write rejected here so which solution is accepted it is a equal to 10 now what was a 3 power 3x plus 1 was a equal to 10 now i will be writing this equation and we will find out x so 3 power 3x plus 1 equal to 10 take away 1 from both sides so 3 power 3x equal to 10 minus 1 9 so 3 power 3x equal to 3 square bases are same so we can conclude exponent should be equal to each other so 3x will be equal to 2 divide both sides by 3 so we will write our answer x is equal to 2 by 3 only real solution let's verify so i will write here check x is equal to 2 by 3 or 3x is equal to 2 so i will put here 3x equal to 2 straight away so i can write here 2 plus see 3 3x in that place then it will be 3 square plus 1 over 2 in lhs in rhs cube root of 3 square plus 241 divided by 2 3 square is 9 plus 1 10 by 2 right hand side it is 3 square is 9 plus 241 250 over 2 so this is 5 right hand side is also 5 it will come as it is cube root of 125 which further we can write cube root of 5 cube it is now cube and cube root will be over so rhs is also 5 lhs is also 5 that means x is equal to 2 over 3 is true and verified solution i hope friends this video will be meaningful to you do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video till then goodbye and take care of yourself bye bye